Hello, Cancer. Welcome to Wasted Traditions. I'm Tiffany. Here we explore the wisdom of the tarot. I read intuitively, offering general insights and guidance, encouraging you to take what resonates with you and leave the rest. But before we get started, I'm going to bless my decks of cards. Divine Spirit, bless these cards with your wisdom and light. As I shuffle and draw, may you may your divine presence guide my readings and illuminate the paths of those seeking answers. So shall it be. Okay, Cancer, let's get started. This is your reading, Cancer, for the week of March 3rd through March 9th. Cancer, did you check out your video last week? If not, I will leave it in the cards and the description below. Comment what resonated with you from last week's video that is still ringing true this week all right let's try these new cards this is the gold foil tarot these cards are very slippery very um shiny <laughs> let's see how well i can work with them without getting them spilled everywhere divine spirit what does cancer need to know do tell Mm-hmm. Very slippery. <laughs> Gonna go ahead and cut that. Let's take a look at the shadow card. The shadow card ends up on the bottom of the deck. And shadow cards generally point to hopes or fears. And here we have the three of cups, and we will get into this shortly, Cancer. All right, Divine Spirit, what does Cancer need to know? For the week of March 3rd through March 9th, we have the Six of Swords, the Four of Wands, and the Knight of Pentacles. Very interesting. There's celebration. There's mastery. There is action. Six of Swords, action. All right. So, with the Six of Swords, Cancer. Something, it's time for you to move on from a situation, Cancer. It's time for you to move forward. That event, that situation, that experience, it's done. It's time to move on. It has served you as best it can. If you stay any longer, it will no longer serve you well. So moving on is important to get to a place of celebration, absolutely. A place of illumination and enlightenment cancer hmm. okay let's get more we're going to get some clarifiers for this and then you have the knight of pentacles hmm. you've been working hard at something cancer and this is it's run its course you can celebrate the success of that hard work you've put in, but it's also time to move on. It has run its course. Let's see what your shadow card is. Your shadow card is the three of cups. And this is pointing to hopes or fears. And I feel like for you, Cancer, this is absolutely a hope. This is joy for you that what you've worked so diligently at it's brought you to a place of celebration it's brought you to a place of joy um you've you used a lot of creativity on this particular project or creative uh outlet so good on you cancer that's beautiful let's get some clarifiers divine spirit clarify this reading for cancer do tell What does Cancer need to know? Clarify. Clarify the Six of Swords, Divine Spirit. Clarify the Six of 
clarify the Six of Swords for Cancer. Okay, that did not want to go back in. All right. So, for the Six of Swords, we got the Four of Pentacles. Time to move on. Because this, this endeavor of yours that you should be moving on from, it has actually... It, it, it required a lot of work of you and it has also brought you to a place of stability and security, which that is absolutely something to celebrate. You've worked very hard at it. And you also want to be mindful, Cancer, to not squander that success okay do not squander that success stay diligent stay responsible what else can you tell me about the six of swords all right the two of swords it is i feel like cancer it's difficult for you to choose to walk away it's difficult for you to choose to move on from this endeavor because it has brought you stability and success but also spirit is saying if you continue to push further than where you are now this could begin to collapse on you so you do need to make the decision and it is a decision into your benefit to go ahead and move on let's clarify this four of wands it's a balancing act. You're balancing your emotions. You know, should I be celebrating this? Absolutely. Well, it feels like there's more to do. No, there's not any more to do. Move on from this um, because there is much more success and celebration ahead for you, Cancer. Hmm. It's you, you're walking a fine line between should I stay or should I go and spirit is absolutely saying you should go with this knight of pentacles that is action that is moving so absolutely celebrate your wins go out on top cancer and move on to the next thing that will elevate you and bring you stability and success with this knight of pentacles you have there it is that's your sun card that is the success your next level success is right there ready for your for the taking ready for you to win again you've won already let's win some more cancer okay this is beautiful all right let's get a single card from the shaman's dream oracle for cancer divine spirit a single oracle card from the shaman's dream oracle what does cancer need to know do tell single card the wall obstacles if you stay and if you continue to push this endeavor that you have already been very successful with cancer you will hit a wall that is why it's important for you to go out on top now go out a winner and and move on to the next best thing for you to bring you more success okay you will find more inspiration if you go ahead and avoid that wall you're inspired to do something new go ahead and do that new thing go out a winner one more card for cancer from the spirit animal oracle divine spirit what spirit animal will cancer embody this week Single card, Divine Spirit. Let's see what we have for Cancer. Won't let it go. Come through. Flamingo Spirit, embrace the in between. Yeah, you'll feel like you're in between emotions right now. You're in between decisions right now, Cancer. Embrace the in between. And listen to your intuition. You do know it's time to go. You do, Cancer. You know it's time. 
and you have your like my grandmother used to say, you're twixt in between about this decision. The right decision for you at this point is to go ahead and make the decision to go out on top. Go ahead and say, this is a major win, very successful, and I'm on to the next thing. And I, and it's okay to feel twixt in between. Don't fight that feeling. Embrace it and know that it is here to help you. You will have more success more abundance, um, and it and it brings you to a level of empowerment. Okay, Cancer. I hope that this reading has resonated with you. You found it useful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos I have for you. I will see you soon, and until then, bye bye.